A distinguished graphic artist and designer, Natalie J. Parker has built an honorable career in her field as the owner of Blaze Designs. Ms. Parker recalls her world shifted in middle school when an art teacher showed an episode of Doctor Who to her class. The episode in which the doctor time traveled to help save Vincent van Gogh from a horde of creatures. She had never known about Vincent van Gogh, but the show and its characterization of the eccentric Dutch painter piqued her interest, sparking a lifelong fascination. From there, she became a dedicated fan of him and his works, writing two or three biographies, watching movies and documentaries, and blogging about him online. With Van Gogh as her all-time favorite artist, she recalls she simply could not stop drawing and painting. Additionally, her grandfather had a book of sketches by another Dutch visionary, M. C. Escher, whose mind-bending and dark works served as an imaginative escape for her. From Escher, she was inspired to create worlds and express other people's stories rather than her own. Following her high school graduation, Ms. Parker struggled to find a job that was the right fit for her, so she decided to turn what she was good at into a business of her own. Since 2019, she has excelled as the owner and graphic designer of Blaze Designs, in which she creates art and digital art for clients through commissions. She works on sketches to begin each project, confirming her work with the clients before moving forward on the official design and specializing in dark designs, as well as working with older photographs. Ms. Parker's unique style and artistic vision reflect how she sees the world differently. It's not super accurate or realistic, she noted, but it's mine. Graphic design continues to appeal to her and her creative mind, as it offers limitless space for creativity and different medians of art. She has found a vast community of artists and entrepreneurs through social media, allowing her to interact and learn from other professionals she admires. Likewise, she draws inspiration from the works of her father, who is also an artist. Upon reflection, Ms. Parker considers her most notable achievement was being invited multiple times to compete for the Bandito Residency, an international art competition with a prize that provides accommodation for several weeks in Italy. The competition is invite only, so one must be recognized by esteemed artists with years of experience. She has also been featured in several magazines for young entrepreneurs and artists. Simply put, she attributes her success to her drive and ability to listen to the needs of her clients and create something for them that goes beyond their expectations. On a more personal level, Ms. Parker has found it incredibly rewarding to see and hear from people who strongly connect with her work. Being an artist, she says, can be a very cynical and challenging way of life. Our minds are constantly filled with screaming and self-criticism, she said. We question everything. It sometimes feels as if we are a different species, but it is so fulfilling to see your work change someone's life. When you do get a genuine reaction, it makes it all feel worth it. Outside of her primary career efforts, Ms. Parker volunteers with her local Boy Scouts of America, as well as for animal shelters in her community. She has recently become a Google certified graphic designer, holds a CPR certification, and has worked as a medical scribe. Looking toward the future, Ms. Parker strives to continually develop her skills and build her business, understanding that progress is often not linear and comes with setbacks. Ultimately, she aspires to work out of her own studio, wanting to be able to live off her art.